On the earth, cruelly minuscule, there once lived a man who was minuscule. The work that he had was minuscule and his briefcase was of minuscule size. The pay he received was minuscule and one day on a lovely morning on his windowsill knocked a little, she then seemed very little, war. The rifle they gave him was minuscule. The boots that they gave him were minuscule. The helmet they gave was minuscule and minuscule also was his coat. And the moment he fell unsightly, improperly, in the cry of attack his mouth bent of the whole earth were the sculptors in quandary how to cover out a lad so grand. <laughs> the sound of harp is silvery and blue. Violin's cries are crystal glittering diamonds. Cellos, molasses sweet and viscous glue. Trumpets red streams swarm sturdy nature's silence. Reed pipe is azure split by fighting, and shattered crystal flight of morn through dew. Bell's tins are slumber pierced by lightning, grand piano racing waves that dash askew. But as the odorous fruit of balmy mangoes exhaling fragrant languor of the spice I ever yearn to leave and to surrender myself to where I was, where Ganges lies, to the lianas of a garden javen where melancholy streams resound with gambling. Thank you very much. Woo!